Hello everyone and welcome to my channel. I'm Claudia. So if you are new to my channel, welcome. And if you are one of my, uh, some, somebody who's a regular on my channel, thank you so much for coming back. I really do appreciate everyone and all of the support that I get. So every time you like my videos and you watch my videos and you subscribe to my channel, it really does help me so that I can produce more and more content for you. So thank you. So I'm going to go ahead and just jump right in. Um, I wanted to talk to you guys today about these Chloe boots. You know, these are some boots that you know, I saw them for some time. I was looking for some rain boots and I wanted just something cool and something edgy. And I found these boots. And, and it's interesting because when I found them, I really wasn't necessarily looking for these boots, but I'll share a little bit of that in a minute. You know, one of the things that I am going to start doing in my videos is that I do want to start sharing with you why I decided to buy the item, what I love about the item, and what I do not like about the item. I do feel like anytime we purchase something, I, I, can, I can't really say that everything that I purchase, I absolutely love it, that there is nothing that I don't like about it. So I wanna be able to at least share that information with you, what I like and what I don't like. So I'm gonna go ahead and just jump right into the boots. So these are the Chloe Betty boots and these are currently on their website. So I'm gonna get a little closer so you can see them. But as you can see, they're, they're the, the leather rubber, more rubber rain boot, but super, in my opinion, super edgy, just like the chunky heel. You could see the bottoms. Very, very cool, but super, super nice and great grip. I will tell you that. They do have some pretty amazing grip. You can see in the back here, it has like this little loop here and it has the Chloe, which I think is pretty, pretty neat. I think it looks very cool and trendy. Um, the side has a zipper, a pretty thick, you can see the thick zipper here, but again, super nice. Um, they're a really nice size. I am going to be modeling these for you guys in a moment so you could see what they look like on, like if you're wearing some jeans and things like that. But I, what I think is really cool is, you know, they're just really neat boots. You know, you can see how edgy they look and they're kind of heavy. I wouldn't say they're heavy, but they're, you know, a decent weight. But, you know, there's not a whole lot to show you about these other than this is what they look like. So I'm going to do a couple of views really quick just to show you what they look like from the side. I'll go ahead and zip them so that you can see what it looks like zipped. And so I found that it's a little bit harder to zip it when you don't have them on. Maybe it's because you don't have that structure, you know, like that support. But this is what they look like when they're zipped. And you can see here, you've got the Chloe there. Again, you can have the Chloe here. But also on the outside, on the side of the boot here, you can see the Chloe. But aside from that, I mean, they're just rubber boots. And um, I'll go ahead and start now. Just I want to jump into why I decided to buy these boots. Well, you know, I was looking for some rain boots initially, but I was, really wasn't sure what I wanted. I saw a couple different brands, one that was from Montclair and just some other brands, and I just really wasn't sure what I wanted. I came across these maybe once, just glanced at them really quick online, but didn't really think about buying them. But it was really interesting because uh, I was on Facebook one day and as you know, I think social media, of course, kind of stalks us. So I was on Facebook and I get like an ad on my Facebook timeline about these boots. And it was a link from uh, Neiman Marcus and it sent me directly to Neiman Marcus website. When I got to the Neiman Marcus website, I noticed that these boots were on sale. They were on sale for $257. Well, if you look on the Chloe website, even today, I think they're $550. But at the time, I you know I saw that they were on sale. I thought that was pretty neat. So I went on the ChloeWebsite.com and noticed that they were $550 on the website and Neiman Marcus was selling them for $257. So I thought that was a really good deal. So that was really initially why I actually bought these boots. So the reason why I bought them was because they were on sale. And you know who doesn't want to get a 50, 60% uh, discount price on a designer item like Chloe? So I said, hey, I think it's worth a shot. I went ahead and ordered them for $257. And I found out that they were on back order. And, you know, I kept getting emails from Neiman Marcus saying that they were still on back order if I wanted to cancel my order. But at the time, I really wasn't in a hurry for them. I actually purchased them in, I believe, March of last year. And I waited for a while. And then I get another, uh, an email from Neiman Marcus. You know, they send you some promo emails. I get one from Neiman Marcus and it was about these boots that they were reduced even more. That at this point, they were $192.75. And of course, I called Neiman Marcus to try to get a price adjustment. And 
to my surprise, they honored it. At first, they didn't really want to, and they couldn't believe that I would get an email with the uh, uh, with these boots even reduced even more. Especially since if you look on the Chloe website, they're five fifty. So I I forwarded the, the customer service agent the email that I had that that showed that they were promoting one hundred ninety two and seventy five cents. So they were able to do a price adjustment. So I actually got these boots for one hundred ninety two and seventy five cents. And it was funny because I ordered them in March. And now we're in April and almost in May. I think we started, we're already in May of last year and I still had not gotten them. And they were, you know, emailing me if I wanted to cancel my order. And I thought, you know what, I'm just going to wait it out for this price. I'm just going to wait. And sure enough, they finally came in in the middle of May, which I was fine with. And I got a really good deal. So, you know, my advice is, hey, sometimes you do see stuff on sale. And if you do get some of those ads on your timeline, sometimes they're really good. So just wanted to share that. And it was a really long answer, you know, a long answer of answering why I bought these boots. But again, I bought, initially really only bought them because they were on sale. Uh, what do I love about these boots? So that one's interesting. Um, there's a lot of stuff that I really love about these boots. But what I really love about these boots is that they have that edgy look, right? They look really edgy and they're so easy to style. Um, you can style these with some jeans. You can style them with a skirt, even a dress. And in my opinion, I think it just goes with everything. So I think that was probably uh, my surprise was that they're, they just go with everything. So I was really, really impressed and actually surprised how much you can just, you know, how many outfits you can wear this with. So I think that's one of the things that I really like about it. So, you know, if you Google Chloe boots, Betty boots, uh, mod shots, you can see tons of different outfits with these boots and they're super cute. So now what do I not like about these boots? You know, the only thing that I would say that I, well, the main thing that I don't like about these boots, I would say is because they're rubber and they're very easy to scratch. So I'm going to see if you can even see the scratches, but you can see if you look really close here with the lighting, you can see a couple little scratches, but again, the rubber. So you expect to see that. So that's probably the only thing I don't like that. And, and maybe that they're a little bit more stiff because they're rain boots, but they're kind of meant to be that way. So they honestly don't bother me. I've worn them with skirts and with jeans and they're actually super cute. Uh, but yeah, I would say the big thing is, you know, that they're easy to scratch. So you might see a bunch of scratches over time if you wear them a lot. But again, it's not a big deal for me. I, I'm good with it. But again, I also got them for a really good price. So um, that's really it when it comes to that. What I may do next is I'm going to do some quick mod shots for you, just so you can see how, th how these look with some jeans. And then we will be done. Okay, so I do want to show you really quick just what they look like. This is what they look like from the front. I'm trying to, I'm trying to stand on this kind of uh, rug just so that you can see them a little bit more because of the dark floor. I'm not sure you're going to be able to see them. But you can see what they look like from the side. But again, super cute in my opinion. I think they're really, really cute. You can see the back. But yeah, I think they're super cute. I would love to hear what you guys think. But yeah, I mean, again, the price, I couldn't beat the price. So yeah, super cute. But hey, if you try this out with a skirt, oh gosh, super cute. Okay, well, that's all I have for you. So thank you so much for visiting my channel. And I hope to see you again.